Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, Mom Life 7. Today I have a 99 cent store haul I wanted to share with you guys. I am still slow motion, so I'm still uh, recording from my bed for right now. Uh, still trying to, you know, get some rest and take it easy. Um, I want to welcome all my new subscribers and I want to thank all my returning subscribers for coming back to be my channel again. And I want to thank everyone for their patience because, you know, I was MIA for a minute, you know, dealing with some health issues and, you know, stuff of that nature. Anyway, um, I don't want to waste too much of you guys' time. If you haven't already, please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. I really appreciate you guys' support. And uh, let me show you what I got. It's like the little stuff I've been collecting over since basically since my last haul. I've been mostly having to, you know, stand the car, send the hubby in, or either you know, send him to the store for me, and, you know, stuff like that. So, uh, anyway, let me get started so I can uh, show you guys what I got. Okay. All right. First up, I have these right here. I haven't been seeing these, but um, I thought the other ones I think came with crackers. This one was a little different because um, it says it's by Hormel. It's called Rev, and it's the Bacon Club. Um, it's a bacon, ham, turkey, and American cheese in a soft white wrap. Um, it's 14 grams of protein. Uh, let me see, 2.6 ounces. Let me see. Expiration date is uh, February 25th, 2018. So I grabbed two of these. Were these two for 99 cents? Or were these 99 cents each? They were two for a dollar. They were two for 99 cents, I believe. Mean. All right. All right. Next up. All right. Uh, we picked up this uh, country crock. Um, it's a spreadable butter. Um, let me see. Spreadable butter with canola oil and salted. Um, it's eight ounces. This was ninety nine cents. And let me see. Do I have an expiration date for you guys? Yeah. Uh, it just says used by February. I don't know if it's February twentieth, two thousand eighteen. It's May is what the month. Right. Anyway, um, even though the date, you guys be quiet. Even though the date was uh, approaching, that's why I only got one. And I figured with this being, you know, butter, I can freeze this. So, you know, and then take out what I need as I need it. So I grabbed that. Okay, another interesting, interesting find was this uh, Smart Ones. This is the uh, Tasty American Favorites uh, Spicy Chicken Slider. You get two um, spicy chicken sliders in here. Um, let's see, 190 calories, 8 grams of fat, 3 grams of protein, no, 3 grams of fiber, 8 grams of protein. Um, these were 99 cents. We grabbed, what, like, 4 of these? I think it was like, no, we grabbed, originally we grabbed 2 or 3, 3. And then my daughter tried them and she really liked them, so we grabbed, uh, what, a couple more today or something like that? Yeah. So, yeah, she really liked these, uh, spicy chicken sliders. I figured she would, so, that was cool. That was a cool find. Like I said, they were 99 cents. Uh, each got that and then another cool find. I think they want to grab what, one of these I think. two we grab two of these okay these are the smart maids by smart ones um this is uh, let me see roasted veg vegetables and um and garlic herb quinoa bowl um it's made with real ingredients you can pronounce made with roasted corn for extra flavor um, smart swap for um, of quinoa for white rice. So instead of a white rice, they put quinoa. So I thought it was pretty interesting. Um, it's 99 cents, so we grabbed like two of those. Another cool find was this uh, Weight Watcher yeah. Smart Ones. This is the uh, Flavorful Asian Inspirations. It's a Thai style white meat chicken and rice noodles. Uh, let me see. Roasted white meat chicken vegetables and rice noodles and a zesty peanut sauce. You have 15 grams of protein. This is 99 cents. We grabbed, how many of these did we grab? Two? Okay, we grabbed two of these. Give it a try. I don't even give you a date on these, huh? Uh, expiration date on this is pretty good. It's August 28th, 2018. And let me see on the smart ones. This one is May 5th, 2018. And on these spicy, ha uh -huh spicy um, chicken sliders okay April 28th 2018 so they all have pretty good expiration dates that's cool okay another interesting and cool find was this um, by devour we we've grabbed some devour before not this variety this is the chicken and waffles um, these were 99 so we got 40s did we grab more but I know we grabbed four 
Um, it's a premium crispy breaded, um, premium crisp, crispy breaded white meat chicken uh, patty strips served with Belgian waffle sticks and a side of syrup for dipping. So yeah, we grabbed four of these for 99 cents each. Pretty good. I think we've seen these. Uh, well, this particular brand devour at a uh, Target, and it was like, were they like three something each or something like that? So for 99 cents, that's a good deal. Another excellent find was this uh, country crock. Um, it's a country crock. Uh, let me see. Shed spread real taste from real ingredients. It's a country fresh taste. Um, it's a, it's a light. Um, it's light. 60% less fat and calories than butter. It's like a buttery spread. Um, it contains no artificial flavors, no artificial preservatives, zero trans fat. Expiration date. Looks like it's March 2018. I don't know the date, but March 2018. So not bad. Um, expiration date. And the cool thing is, is this is like a, a, a two pound tub. So it's two pounds. Uh, it's pretty good. So it's a big, really big. And that's really good for 99 cents, you guys. Really good. Alright. Well, another cool find was these. <laughs> Which you can see there. Basically, they're gone. These were uh, these were a 24 pack of Go-Gurts. Uh, they expired, um, I believe, yesterday. We actually put these in the freezer, so we basically turned them to frozen yogurt. It was a uh, strawberry banana in a cotton candy variety, and you got 24 in there, and that was really good for 99 cent for 24 of these. So yeah, we froze them. So the, the kids tried them today as frozen yogurt, and they really liked them. <laughs> All right. Another cool find was this, um, I can't believe it's not butter. This is like the little, um, butter spray. Okay, it's 100% taste, zero calories, uh, great for topping and cooking. Can't believe it's not butter, zero trans fat preserving. All, it's an olive oil one variety. Um, expiration date. Look like it's February, is this say February 2018? I don't know what date, but anyway. I'm not worried about the date too much, you know, you could spray this like on your vegetables or a baked potato or something, you know, baked potato or something like that. So, yeah, I thought it was pretty cool for 99 cents. Okay, another cool farm was this uh, Minute Maid um, Pink Lemonade. Minute Maid Pink Lemonade, 100% natural flavor. It's 59 full, fluid ounce um, carton. Expiration date February 27, 2018. These were 99 cents. We only grabbed one of these, right? Yeah, only, we only grabbed one of these. Another excellent farm was uh, my favorite brand of tea. This is the Gold Peak Tea. Um, this is the Lemonade Tea. My daughter really loves this lemonade flavor. I think we grabbed like three of these. We got three of these. Um, I don't know about the date, you guys. Okay, I see something here. Uh, what did I just say? March. March 12, 2018, it look like. Look like it's March 12. So anyway, we got three of these for 99 cents. That's an excellent buy for this brand. We also grabbed two of these um, Gold Peak Peach Teas. Gold Peak Peach Tea. We grabbed two of those. I don't know what the date is for 99 cents. I see something here. I can't really see what it is. Uh, Alright, well anyway, I'm not going to waste too much time on the date. I can't. Let me make it up what it is. Hmm. All right. Anyway, we got two of those. Another excellent find was this uh, Boat House Farms. Um, this is the vanilla chai tea. All right. And you know, this stuff is really expensive. Expiration date on here is March 19th, 2018. It says heart healthy. Um, vanilla chai tea. Uh, let me see. It's seven grams of protein per serving. Perfectly protein tea and soy beverage. It's a 32 fluid ounce bottle, so that's the big one, and that's a good deal for that for 99 cents, you guys. We keep moving along. Okay, I also picked up this Zola uh, coconut water. Now I told you guys before, previously, that my favorite brand of uh, coconut water is Sprouts, but I would have to say that Zola is is my second favorite brand of coconut water. Um, and I know this ain't cheap. They sell this at Safeway. They sell it at uh, ver uh, various different um, stores. Uh, let me see. This is naturally hydrating uh, Zola coconut oil. This is the pineapple juice. The coconut water pineapple juice is a one liter. You get 60, cal 60 calories per 8 ounce serving. Let me see what else can I tell you about it. Not really too much I can tell you. But anyway, for 99 cents, this is excellent. Let me see. Nat okay, natural um, natural electrolytes, 14 milligrams of potassium per eight ounce, uh, eight fluid ounce serving. 
not from concentrate, no added, sh no sugar added. It's a ve vegan ingredient. It's gluten free. So yeah, that's really good. And I, gra I grabbed two of these. I really probably should have grabbed more, but yeah, I did grab two. You know, so that was that was really excellent find as well. What else I got? All right, right here. These um, this one is uh, this is the cafe latte, naturally flavored. Okay, a sweet blend of milk, arabica, and ro robusta coffees. Okay. I know, this is a cafe latte. Mm, let me see what else can I tell you about it. And then we also got this one. This is the cappuccino. Pretty much the same thing. Yeah, sweet blend of milk and arabica and robusta uh, coffees. These were, I think they were, were they 99 cents or 2 for 99 I think they were 99 cents each. Anyway, so we're going to give those a try. Expiration date on this one is June 21st, 2019. This one is June 21st, 2019 as well. So yeah, we're gonna give those a try. My daughter had been bugging me about some Nestle Quick. So this is a tiny one. And um, so I just decided to get it for her since it was 99 cents. Uh, I'm sure everybody's familiar with this chocolate Nestle uh, Quick uh, chocolate syrup. Uh, let me see, do I have an expiration date? You know, you just add uh, any kind of milk to this to make your own chocolate milk. I don't see a date. Sure. Okay, it looks like it's March 2019. Or is it April? Hmm. Look like it's April. April 2019, you guys. Okay. Right. Another cool find was this craft uh, mayo. This is the home style rich and creamy uh, real mayonnaise. Uh, let me see here. What else can I tell you about? It's 30 fluid ounces, so that's really good for 99 cents. Um expiration date the reason i got this even though i had got that big one in a previous haul is because i had to use that big one really soon and this one doesn't expire to april 13th 2018 so i got more time to use this i could probably use this up until probably around easter or something so for 99 cents i thought it was an excellent deal so i grabbed that also grabbed this planter's peanut butter i didn't really need peanut butter and um i'm more of a cashew butter type of girl but anyway this is the planter's creamy peanut butter and this is a 18 fluid ounce. So I never had planters peanut, uh, peanut butter before. I used to get either Jif or Skippy. And um, expiration date is August 22nd, 2018. So it's a good expiration date for 99 cents. I thought I'd give it a try. See if we like it. Another cool find was this Kraft One Step Coleslaw Maker dressing. <clears throat> Just add the shredded cabbage. Um, 22 fluid ounces. Um, I never made my own cap uh, coleslaw before. I always wanted to. My stepfather used to make ours, you know, homemade. So it used to be really, really good. So I'm gonna give it a try and see uh, if I can make it work. Um, expiration date is April 9th, 2018. So I thought it was pretty good um, for 99 cents. I think that's an excellent deal. Uh, uh, interesting find with these noodles. Za Wang um, noodle dish with roasted mild black bean sauce. So yeah, I've um, never seen these before. They're by uh, whatever this brand is, Nansh, Nanshim, Nanshim or somebody. <laughs> anyway, I think it was 99 cent, right? Okay, 99 cent. So we only bought one to give it a try and see if we like it. Another cool find is Velveeta, this uh, liquid gold Velveeta skillet one pan dinner kit uh, this is the down home mac and cheese i don't know if it tastes as good as homemade probably not but anyway it's a creamy cheese sauce with pasta and seasonings ready in 20 minutes just add bacon okay so i guess you add bacon to this is 12 ounces so i'm sure my daughter will enjoy making this for the kids if you like to find an expiration date oh, yeah i have something here it's april 12 2018 so for 99 cents, I thought that was pretty cool. Alright. Another cool find was these Bigfoot. <laughs> I've never seen these before. Okay, Bigfoot. Let me see. Allen by Allen. Let me see. Big, uh, Bigfoot by Allen. Okay, made with real fruit juice. Let me see. It's a gummy candy. It's a 10 ounce package. This is uh, the original right here. And then this right here, the blue one is the sour oh, hi, blue. Baby. Okay, baby. Hi, baby. It's the sour blue raspberry. And this one is also made with real sweet juice. And these were 99 cents, so I thought they were pretty interesting. You know, we like, you know, kind of stuff like that. All right. 
another uh, amazing find was this uh, Quaker chewy yogurt flavored coating. Okay, chewy yogurt uh, flavored coating. These are some um, like yogurt bars. Okay, it's a variety pack. You get seven strawberry and you get seven blueberry. It's a value pack, like I said, 14 bars. They come with 11 grams. It contains 11 grams of whole grains. It's a good source of calcium. I already said you get 14 in there. Uh, let me see what's the date on here. Expiration date. Okay, April 3rd, 2018. So, yeah, for a variety pack, a value pack, or whatever it's called, um, of these chewy uh, granola bars, I thought that was pretty good for 99 cents. Definitely. All right, another cool find is I've even never seen these before. These are the Chips Ahoy by Nabisco. Uh, so it's all like so far I'm bringing you a bunch of uh, amazing name brands. Um, it's a cinnamon donut. It's a chewy Chips Ahoy. Um, let me see. Uh, cinnamon and apple donut flavored chips. Okay, it's a limited edition. Let me see. Uh, what else? There's there soft cookies, 130 calories. Yeah, what else can I tell you guys about? Let me see if I can find a date. That would be great. It's April. April 6, 2018. Yeah. Alright, so for 99 cents for this brand, I thought it was an excellent find. And we'll give it a try. Alright. So have you picked up these, y'all? I don't know why. Risen. Um, chewy chocolate caramel covered in rich European chocolate. Alright, so anyway, 99 cents. We'll give those a try. I don't know why he picked up these little things. You get four, it's a four pack. You get two cookies per pack. I don't know why, but anyway. These are Oreo cookies. Everybody's familiar with this. It was 99 cents. I don't think it was that great of a deal. I think we could have got waited and, you know, found something better for 99 cents. Uh, expiration date. I look like it's May. I don't know. It's probably May this year. I can't see the whole date anyway now this i do think was an excellent deal because this is the family size uh, oreos and this is the limit oreos the only thing would have made it more excellent if these were the thins <laughs> me and my daughter we really like the oreo thin so anyway this is a family size so this is an excellent buy for 99 cent you guys let me see how many ounces this okay it's one pound and four ounces so that's yeah that's big it's, it's heavy it's uh, the only way i would have been able to afford it is that the 99 cents store, huh? Let me see. What's the date? I'm trying to find a date. Hmm. Okay, I see something right here. Oh, okay. Yeah. February 26, 2018. So, yeah, we're going to eat these really, really quick, you guys. Really, really quick. I'm going to make sure those are done. The 99 cents. That's excellent. All right. We also picked up, check this out. The Mystery Oreo. Limited edition. Uh, let me see here. By Nabisco, of course. Mystery flavor. Okay, guess the flavor for a chance to win fifty thousand dollars. <laughs> yeah, I can use fifty thousand dollars for sure. Y'all, let's all get together and guess the flavor and split it. <laughs> Let me see. Expiration date March tenth, two thousand eighteen. So yeah, for ninety nine cent. Hey, to try a mystery flavor, I thought that was an excellent deal. All right. We also picked up these um, Pure Growth Organic cheddar monkeys i thought that was pretty um interesting these are new uh, let me see non-gmo no artificial uh flavors made with real cheddar cheese baked in the usa we picked up the pure growth um organic brand before but not the cheddar monkeys so this would be a first for us for this variety and uh, i'm gonna find a date on here yeah that'd be nice if i could find a date Jeez. let's see here well, for some reason, I can't, you guys. Oh, okay. I see something. All right. April 3rd, 2018. So, yeah, for $0.99, cent, we'll definitely give that a try, you guys. All right. We also picked up these uh, hauls. Uh, these are what, cherry flavor. You get 14 hauls in here. So, yeah, for $0.99, cent, you know, we thought we'd give it a try. We usually, I prefer the strawberry, but, you know, hey, cherry. It was $0.99, cent, you get 14. We've been uh, needing little cough drops and things like that lately, so. Let me see. Expiration date August 10th, 2019. So that's an excellent, excellent date, you guys. All right. We also picked up these um, Craft Jet Puff. Uh, okay, it said Marlo, Marlo Bites. I guess Marshmallow Bites. Marlo Bites. <laughs> this is Caramel and Vanilla Swirl Marshmallows. Okay. So, yeah, I thought these were pretty interesting. I'm sure the kids want to try these. 
caramel and vanilla, y'all. Y'all hear that? They got so many different varieties. I'm trying to find a date on here. Let me see. It was 99 cents, so hey. Okay, I see the date. March 5th, 2018. We got an impatient five-year-old that wants, uh, wants these Magnify cars. Else? So yeah. Yeah, you. Five-year-old. <coughs> anyway. Mm. All right. <laughs> really? Come on. Okay, look. Let me just show the people. These are BJ's cars. Okay, here. Take them. Bye. Bye. Here. All right. He's been sick to you guys. So yeah. When it rain, it pours. Okay. So... Another cool and interesting find is this Honest Tea. Um, so just a just a tad sweet Honest Tea. Yeah, and I, I've tasted it before. It's not really that sweet. I've got these before uh, Sprouts. What are Sprouts? Uh, local Sprouts, Sprouts Market. And let me see. It's organic. Let me see. It says uh, Lori's Lemon Tea. It's 59 fluid ounces. Uh, what else can I tell you guys about it? If I can find a date. Uh, that would be great. I don't even know what the date is, you guys. Okay, let's see if it's on the cap. No. Okay, I see something here. Okay, you guys, be quiet. March 5th, look like. Look like it's March 5th, 2018. So anyway, for 99 cents, I know this is a really good deal because I know how much this stuff costs for the small bottle at a Sprout. So yeah, all right. And that was 99 cents, by the way. Another cool find was this uh, Enjoy Life caramel apple baked chewy bars they had uh two other varieties in this we just decided to only get this one they did have all three varieties at our store but we only got this one it's saying now 15 percent larger they're milk free nut free soy free now featuring H ancient grains uh no artificial anything um you get five bars in here um gluten free and free from the eight common allergens now let me see do we have a date yeah, May 13, 2018. So, yeah, this is 99 cents. So, I think that was an excellent deal. All right, so another cool find was these Hostess Bakery Petites. These are a repeat buy. This is the, um, <clears throat> excuse me, Chocolate Chunk Brownie Delights. And we really like these. My daughter came over and she really liked them. She likes brownies anyway. So, let me see what's the expiration date. March 11, 2018. So, yeah, we was really excited to find these again because these are really. Um, good last time we tried them and for 99 cents that's an excellent deal for the hostess petites all right another interesting find well our cool find was this uh, Nabisco Chips Ahoy um, chocolate chip cookies made and let me see real chocolate chip cookies now I didn't know that the hubby grabbed the reduced fat I would have rather left them at the store but anyway we'll give it a try maybe we need to reduce the fat anyway huh uh, we'll see <laughs> Reduced fat. My aunt would be like, uh-uh, don't give me the reduced fat, no reduced flavor, anything. <laughs> but yeah, okay. We'll give it a try for 99 cents. You know, that's all we pretty much wasted. So if it was if it's not good. Expiration date is March 16, 2018. So yeah, everybody's I was actually looking for the non-reduced fat ones that were the family size I kept seeing everybody get. So no, we didn't find those, you guys, unfortunately. All right, but now check this out. Now, I was really, really excited about these. Uh, Sway to the 99 had hit me on uh, Instagram and he sent me a picture of this. And these are the Laura Bra Bites. This is a you get a, a two varieties in here, two flavors. You get the apple pie and you get the chocolate chip cookie dough. So, how cool is that? You get 18 of them in there, you guys. And these are so expensive for 99 cents for this whole 18 pack. Come on now, that's amazing. Uh, they're gluten free, dairy free, vegan, non GMO verified. What else can I tell you guys? Let me see if I can tell you guys a date. Expiration date. Now, this is what's really uh, got to uh, make these amazing fine. Expiration date is May 9th, uh, 2018. Right around my birthday, y'all. Um, is that for the expiration date? I don't know. Your, your birthday is the day after mine. Oh, okay. Well, yeah, that's not you giving your mother's birthday. I said May 9th. <laughs> she said, mind your business. Mind your business. I know your mama's birthday, boy. Anyway, <laughs> so this makes it even more amazing because of the date. It doesn't expire to May. And I, you know, you would think for this, they would break, you know, they're notorious for breaking up stuff. So I'm surprised they didn't break these up. But yeah, we're going to give these a try for sure, you guys. Yeah. 99 cent. That's player right there. That's real player. All right. What else we got going on here? All right, 
Now, I thought this was cool because I had saw someone post uh, a picture of these horrible, which is our favorite gummy bears, by the way, you guys. These are Happy Hoppers, the gummy candy. Now, they said it's a 9-ounce package, 9.5 ounce. Now, the cool part was I, when they posted them, and if these are the same size, they were $1.99. So, when we got these, actually, do you see a $1.99 sticker on it? No, you don't. Mm-hmm. We got these for 99 cents. And then we went back and went to another store where the hubby went. And he said, oh, my God. He took a picture. He said, they are $1.99. So, we were lucky enough to get these for 99 cents. It has a good date. My daughter had found a date for me earlier. Who did you find a date at, daughter? Oh, I see something. Oh, is that it? Oh, okay. Uh, this before end. Oh, okay. January 2019. So, these don't aspire to next year, you guys. Next year. So that's excellent. For 99 cents. He was like, he wanted to grab more. And I said, nah, we good. The kids got enough junk. And we can't. Even though my daughter would probably tear these up. But yeah. 99 cents, y'all. That was amazing. All right. Another interesting and cool find. Not really too interesting, but cool. Good, good buy. These uh, Hostess Donuts. Expiration date on these are March 9th, 2018. My son, we have been hiding these for him. Waiting to get this haul out. He saw them today. We pulled out and he went, pulled them out. He went ham and he started falling out, throwing a tantrum. So I didn't want to hear the noise because I'm trying to keep my stress level down. So I went on with the boy tearing to him. So anyway, these are the glazed mini donuts. You know, we got to pick and choose our battles, y'all. And I was not about to fight with a five year old today. <laughs> anyway, yeah. So for hostess, you already know that's good for 99 cents. He loves his donuts. <laughs> yep, we let him have them. I was not about to fight. All right. Another cool find was these giant size cookie crisp cereals general mills um it says the first ingredient is whole grain expiration date is excellent august 2nd 2018 so yes family size this is what 24.3 ounces got box tops on it and everything so yeah uh no high fructose fructose torn cor corn syrup <laughs> i'm telling ty no colors from artificial sources no artificial flavors yet all right 99 cent that's amazing y'all awesome good deals i'm bringing y'all right all right another cool find was these pure rope organic veggie chips and this is the ranch variety they had a um it's like a sea salt they got a, some other varieties out there but we just happened to say you know we want to try to ranch ones they're organic they're gluten-free made with um uh, turn around the back read it, trying to be all fancy huh okay made with peas spinach and tomatoes all right popped in the usa oh they're popped okay all right I see. All right, let me see. Do I got a date on here for you guys? Uh, that would be great. I can find a date. Sheesh. Of course I can't because I'm filming. Yeah. All right. Well, at this point, it don't really matter, y'all. We're going to eat them and get them to try. They on here somewhere, I'm sure. Anyway, 99 cents. So that was, that was excellent. Another cool find was these. These are the uh, Welcome to Indiana. Welcome to popcorn indiana indiana population 42 now i like I, I i got this variety this is the aged white uh cheddar popcorn the reason i got this because this one came in the value size so i thought hey you know for value size that's amazing uh may like it's may 1st 2018 it has a really good expiration date for 99 cents that's a good deal uh of course anytime you get popcorn they're whole grain so one thing you feel good about eating popcorn is 6.5 ounces it feels pretty cool though. I mean, it feel like I can feel the popcorn all the way up to the top. So yeah, for 99 cents, yeah, I thought that was cool. All right. We also got these, um, the same uh, brand, but these are the toasted coconut uh, drizzle corn. So this is a limited edition. Expiration date, uh, May 4, 2018. Well, we got a lot of birthdays in May. <laughs> yep, so that was good for 99 cents, you guys. This is only a five ounces, so it's not that much of a difference for the other size. All right. Another cool find was this. Uh, I'm going to mess this up, y'all. Popcorn with tahine. Uh, tahine. I don't know how it's pronounced. I have some of this, actually. This stuff right here. Um, let me see. Pop Gourmet. Let me see. Do I have a date? Uh, Gluten-free. Okay. Zero grams trans fat. Uh, let me see. This is a four-ounce bag. See if I can find a date. Oh, okay. Yeah. 
okay april 1st 2018 so someone had um had mentioned on instagram that they um they can't stop eating these so i can't wait to tear these and try them you know so hey give those a try see what they taste like all right you may have remembered in a previous haul i had got these in the was it chocolate hazelnut so um i got these uh in the vanilla to give these a try so yeah uh, let me see if I can pronounce the brand Baduco or something like that. Baduco. Anyway, the wafers, I like these because they weren't as sweet as the other one, the original gourmet ones. Let's see if I have a date on here. Expiration date. Hmm. I think it could look like it could be October 7, 2018. So, yeah, we thought we'd give these a try in the vanilla variety. Alright. Another. Uh, cool find was these Benitos. These are the pinto bean chips. Uh, and these are better cheddar and sour cream. They have some other varieties out there too, but we decided this is the variety we wanted to try. Um, let me see. Expiration date is June 13, 2018. These are high in fiber. They're gluten free. They're non GMO. Five grams of protein per serving. So, yeah, we're going to get those to try. My aunt like pinto beans. I've been seeing people talking about only old people like pinto beans. I like black beans and red beans. <laughs> white beans. All right, this is a repeat buy. This is the uh, VA Splash uh, Raspberry Lemonade. Excellent source of vitamin C. 64 full ounce bottles. 99 cent expiration date on this is April 19, 2018. So, yep. It's a good date, you guys. All right, let me see where do I want to go. Oh, let's go here. All right, uh, I was seeing people post this, the Silken Tofu and so uh, the hubby ran into it and I said yeah go ahead and grab one because when he said silken I didn't know it was like the light firm I thought it was like the soft one but anyway I know that when you get the silken tofu a lot of people use these in their smoothie so you know if you're like vegan and you know vegetarian and stuff like that you know excuse me you can use this in your smoothies you guys now what was interesting was that he was telling me and I checked guess what it's a um recipe on here for a cheesecake you guys easy cheesecake so I thought that was pretty interesting so if any you got any of you guys made some use some tofu to make your cheesecake let me know and let me know how it try uh can't turned out i would like to actually even try this try this recipe you know i make my own you know got my own way of doing the cheesecake but i thought it'd be interesting to try anyway but yeah I, I, when i got it normally i get the firm tofu and i you know i, I sauteed it you know when i uh i haven't had tofu in a while but when i did eat it and um so like i said in the silken one you know i know you can use it in the smoothie so yeah 99 cent thought i'd give it a try and this one is like one that you don't have to refrigerate until after you open it okay so thought that was pretty interesting let me see what else i got going on here all right um uh, we grabbed uh, some more of these uh these friends um oh my God, here guys okay the friends um just fine moscato this is the original peach peach moscato i had i think another like a strawberry one it was another flavor in my in one of my other hauls so i didn't have this one they were out and i found it so yeah this is the um original peach moscato like i said someone that um i run into when i'm shopping she always, she told me she always grabbed a bunch of these she told me that they're really good so i trust her i haven't tried them yet but i i believe that when she said they're good so that's why i've been grabbing them to give them a try um only six six percent alcohol per volume so yeah uh yeah we're gonna, we only grab two of these to give them a try okay guys another interesting find was this dole um jaha is a jaya jaha it's 100 percent juice from concentrate with uh added ingredients this is a pineapple mango no sugar added non-gmo uh excellent source of vitamin c is 8.4 fluent ounce um can uh, like I said it's uh, pineapple mango and then this one right here is the pineapple banana same information same stuff no sugar added and all that kind of good stuff uh, let me see if it's an expression date on here uh, yeah September 25th 2018 for the mango uh, I mean pineapple banana and then the pineapple mango expiration date uh ha. October 1st 2018 I think these were 99 cents they could have been 2 for 99 I have to ask the hubby I'm not sure how much those were anyway okay another interesting find or cool find was this for my daughter um these are these i didn't like that they were my one i nine of course i didn't like the price so uh, the first time i saw them i didn't grab them i just took a picture and posted on instagram <laughs> and then i started thinking about it i said oh, she'll probably enjoy them because they come each uh each bottle of polish comes with the um with hair ties and uh, this is secret life of pets so i decided to go ahead and get it for her and uh, 
get bonus hair ties, ages three and over. So you come with all these there. You come with six of these and um, all of them have a hair tie. So yeah, $1.99, I grabbed it for my daughter. Another interesting find was this, um, it's an auto drink holder. So I guess it goes like in a little vent thing and then you can put your little, um, it's like a cup holder, you know, put your little, attach it and then you get, um, place a drink in there. So yeah, 99 cent, thought we'd give that a try. Uh, another interesting find. Of course, I wasn't happy about paying $1.99 because when I'm at the 99 cent store, I want everything to be. This is it's the 99 cent only store. I want everything to be 99 cent only. All right. And uh, these are uh, it's a three pack uh, reading glasses and say uh, reading glasses for dummies. Now um, they had they came in different strengths. I told the hubby just grab me the weakest strength, which was the plus one one point five zero whatever. I thought I can use these for something. I have some glasses, but I don't really, really use them. Anyway, I don't know. It looks like it's two blacks and a, uh, a purple. I actually priced these. How much were these? Were they like eleven ninety nine? Or I think I priced them on Amazon or something like that. But they were way, um, way more than one ninety nine. So I decided to go ahead. I sent them back to go double back and grab these for me. You know. So yeah, it comes in different strengths, as you can see. You know, one fifty two. 250 and 3 so yeah I, I don't think my eyes are that bad so I just got the weakest strength <laughs> all right another interesting find was these right here uh, I got four of them they're um they're called fresh drops they're new I saw someone post a picture and I'm like what the heck it reminded me of ones that I saw in a commercial and someone um uh commented on Instagram they said they buy the the potpourri I guess it's the ones I saw in the commercial and I just happened to see because I really watch commercials. And uh, they buy it at Pier 1 for $10. And this was $0.99, cent, you guys. So, no more odors. Creates odor blocking layer. So, bathroom odor pre prevention. I think someone said you put it in the toilet. Okay, fresh drop before you go. No one will ever know. Okay, so before you go, you put this in here. We have two bathrooms, by the way. <laughs> so, I decided to grab. I had grab, was grabbing two. And I said, you know what? Let me grab two more. You know, just in case they are really as good. I had a couple people told me they were good. Another person who said they want to try them. And I told them to let me know how these work compared to the ones from Pier, uh, Pier 1 Imports. So, yeah. Because I know Pier 1 ain't cheap. <laughs> you see, I'm at the 99 cents, though, not Pier 1. So, anyway, I grabbed uh, 40s. They were 99 cents each. So, if anybody else used them, let me know how they work. But I heard they were good. I haven't tried them yet. So, yeah, I'm going to give them a try since we do have two bathrooms in the house. All right. Another interesting find was these. I had saw these and I took a picture and posted on Instagram. And for some reason, it was one of those things I couldn't get off my mind. I kept thinking, I could use this in my house in the decor somewhere. And so, I, I sent the hubby back to go hunt them down and grab me. Got two greens and a, a purple. So, I'm going to put these in my house in the design any, um, somewhere in my house. I don't know exactly where yet, but um, I'll figure something out. And yeah, these were 99 cents. You know, they weren't as big as I would like them to be, but yeah, they're cool for 99 cents, I think. You know. And then, another cool find was uh, um, Vian Rodriguez had posted, um, I don't know which design, but because she's posted several of these and what was interesting when she posted you know these were 199 and i was not happy about the price but when she posted it she had posted back I, obviously i'd be so busy and i just be rushing that i don't even check the back of anything how, how, how dumb is that <laughs> and it showed that even though these are 199.99 cent store they sell for 21.99 at cold so i was like well heck that's like let me see 21.99 that mean we say basically what 20 dollars so yeah 20 dollars difference than what we would have paid for them at cold so i saw this butterfly one i thought was really really cute and it says embrace life so i couldn't pass it up and i just said no i gotta have it they had like a one that looked like a little sun they have a lot of different ones out there that's another one that i'm thinking about getting and then i also saw this one <clears throat> or the hubby saw it and told me about it and then i looked it up and saw it and i said oh yeah i want that one it has like a little lock on it family it, okay it said family is the heart of the home so yeah family is the heart and it's a locket i guess it's a heart shaped kind of locket but anyway 199 and again at kohl's 21.99 so I, I guess i need to start reading the back and checking on the original price that that's labeled at the store i don't be never thinking about that you guys but yeah shout out to being rodriguez um uh, you know doing that and let me know to look for that all right another interesting find she had posted these 
and I was like, you know, I actually make reed diffusers, and I actually make candles, I make incense, I make all that stuff. I haven't made it in a while, but I need to get back into it. People keep keep requesting it. So, anyway, um, this is right here. This one is a. Uh, I didn't realize how big they were because I didn't go in the store. I had sent the hubby in. This is by Natural Breeze Premium Fragrance wild lavender reed diffuser and it were $2.99 so you know I definitely wasn't happy about the price but what happened is let me see four fluid ounces and it, it, it's really but this is big you guys this is really big I don't know if you can see and this other variety I got was the French vanilla $2.99 but when I looked it up where I found it that was on Amazon for $45 now and that was the only one that I was able to Fine and price compare. So I said there must be something special going on with these. So I decided to grab these two. It was another fragrance there, I believe, but I didn't grab that one. Just I had, well, I had the hubby to grab just these two. So yeah, I grabbed these and uh, hopefully we enjoy using those. All right. Another um, cool find was this uh, sunscreen. I had posted some pictures of some sunscreen and then I decided to go back and uh, have him or you know, have him to go back and get some. This is by Fruit of the Earth. They're new. It says, Love That Sun. It's for kids. Natural sunscreen. Ultra Lotion. SPF 50. And, you know, the summer is coming. The sun is out. You're supposed to, you know, protect your skin every day that you go out. No matter whether it's, you know, summer or not. And, you know, in the summer, you know, we're outdoors a lot at all the parks in our area. And, we're at, you know, we have a pool here and stuff like that. So, yeah. Six full ounces. You know, we can never get enough sunscreen around here. So, yeah. 99 cents thought that was cool and then this right here block up um it's an aloe vera uh after sun gel we have some aloe vera gel that we use uh, i think we get it from walmart and uh, i thought you know you know this was interesting you know it's by fruit of the earth as well and you know i thought for 99 cent why not you know give this brand a try and this this is a 16 uh, ounce bottle so i thought that was excellent for 99 cent all right then nothing special just some ziploc bags nothing special then we picked up all right also grabbed this i had seen someone grab these i think it was um uh, what is her name i'm trying to think of her name on youtube i can't think of it i know on instagram she's lily black oh, i can't think of her name yeah i'm sorry i apologize but anyway i only grabbed one i think she grabbed more than one and these are, i guess they like soup bowls or you know mugs or something and i thought this was really cute with the white and the pink inside i thought this was really cute and for 90 when i seen it with 99 cents i'm like hey let me grab me some too so yeah 99 cent and I have been seeing these for a long time the first person I seen grab these was pretty and flawed and then uh, I seen being Rodriguez you know kept grabbing them and then she, I remember her mentioning something about the unicorn ones being so popular and everybody wanting to get them and can't find them so I'm like I see these all the time so I said well maybe I kept you know wanting to grab some because pretty and flawed has showed how you stack them they're stackable you can stack them and stuff like that and i can but i had grabbed the the tall ones like similar to these they i grabbed the tall ones in a previous haul down the line so um i decided to go ahead and grab these two unicorn ones because you know they are really cute you know i hadn't wanted to grab some of these short ones anyway so i finally you know got me the unicorn ones another um interesting and cool find was these um tie pods um, these were six for a dollar now Tide is my go-to brand. I've been using it for years um, And I used to use the pods when the pods came out. I was so excited. I jumped on it But then I started having issues with them. I guess since I have like one of those um, Front loading machines my LG washer and dryer is a front loading model and it just like sometime it, it dissolves into my clothes and you know, there's a clump of laundry detergent or product on there and I got tired of that happening so I just recently switched back to, to the liquid Tide Pods but I thought these were cool for to take on vacation because we may be taking a vacation soon maybe possibly to Disneyland so you know you at the hotel and you're doing laundry or vacation home last year we were in Lake Tahoe and our vacation home had a washer and dryer so you know stuff like this come in handy um, let me see you get 60 for a dollar I think we grabbed like 18 of them so yeah and then sometimes, you know, people come over trying to take your laundry just to give them a pod and you know, throw it in. My kids always come over. They're notorious for bringing their laundry. And then I've seen people posting these, um, Ty, but actually they were the older defense ones. And someone told me they got them for $2.99. I price checked them. They go for like $10 at um, Walmart. But these right here aren't the older defense. These are the Brights and Whites Rescue uh, in wash laundry booster and they're $2.99 as well you get 27 of these the other ones you got 18 of them 
um, these um, you get more but these are these go for like eight dollars at Walmart versus ten dollars for the older booster ones which I cannot older defense or something like that I can find those anyway so these are uh, fights uh, dinginess and dullness uh, restores whites and brightens so I, I think you I think they're safe for colors and whites um, just like a little laundry booster like I said you get 27 in here for $2.99 so I thought that was an excellent deal especially when I found out these go for $8 I grabbed three bags of these by the way you guys I really wanted to grab more like I said the Tide Pods I grabbed 18 of those uh, be good you know for vacation and stuff like that okay guys well we've reached the final and the fun portion of the haul makeup makeup we're gonna do some swatches for you guys so me and my daughter she decided to help me tonight <laughs> so how cool is that all right Okay, y'all that's it for the makeup portion and that's gonna complete uh, my 99 cents store haul the makeup was 99 cents so I thought it was amazing because I got a lot of covergirl I got some Maybelline I got some Milani I got the makeup wipes I got lashes pretty much everything lip I got lippies and everything so yeah I thought that was pretty cool I think all the colors I got and all the products I got today were um, you know a good value and I think they were all really cute and I can't wait to you know play in them or have my daughter to play them play on them on us or whatever you know so yeah let me see let me make sure I haven't forgot anything yeah I think that's it so anyway um, please don't forget to like comment share and subscribe if you haven't already let me know uh, what you guys got um, have you guys tried any of these makeup products do you think I found good deals in makeup um, I hadn't found any makeup since that last makeup haul with the Kardashian beauty and I think I got some stuff right after it but other than that, um, makeup up here has been pretty scarce. So I was very uh, happy when the hubby walked in and said he found some. I just, you know, talked to him on the phone, tried to talk him through it, me and my daughter, to help him pick out some stuff for us. <laughs> and so, yeah, I, I'm pretty happy with what I found, you know. And I know in the drugstore, these are way more, you know, than what I paid for them. And these wipes, um, too, I know they're way more than a dollar. Uh, let me see um, if you have if you aren't already please follow me on Instagram you guys I post a lot of a lot of um, cool finds there that I may buy and I may not buy and it's the same handle as my YouTube channel the mom life 7 also follow a nice young gentleman down in the San Francisco Bay Area sway to the 99 he um, posts a lot of amazing um, 99 cents or finds down there as well and also Vienna Rodriguez down in Southern California. Um, she posts a lot of amazing finds on Instagram and she has a YouTube channel as well. And she rocks the 99 and she's doing Dollar Tree hauls and she's doing other stuff as well. So yeah, uh, please um, subscribe to her channel. And she gets her videos up way faster than me right now. I'm, you know, just trying to get back into the swing of things. Let me make sure I didn't forget anything. I had some notes. Let me see. Oh. Uh, collab me and her are planning a collaboration so if you guys have any ideas let us know we're going to be trying to do a collaboration really soon I'll be forgetting to mention it she usually mentions it on her channel but I forget to I forget to mention it on mine and it also giveaway I have uh, over 400 subscribers now so when I reach 500 I'm going to do a appreciation giveaway to let you guys know that I really really do appreciate you guys so yeah look out for that um, We'll, uh, when it get when we get around 500 we'll announce the giveaway and we'll announce the rules and all that kind of good stuff and um, all the information on that and let you know how long the giveaway is going to run for and uh, like I said I want to make sure you know everyone know that I do appreciate them you know I really appreciate you guys appreciate you guys I appreciate you guys support and uh, like I said I want to keep you guys too much longer I want to make sure I shout out all, all the people I want to shout out um, and um, I know I shout out Phone Jones before because she helped me get a lot of my subscribers by, you know, hosting a networking party for the new and um, small YouTubers uh, like myself. I think, what is it? Today was the deadline or tomorrow? Tomorrow's the deadline for 
uh, you to reach so many subscribers and I guess um, watch hours, which I don't have, by the way, but that's fine, you know. It's okay. I'm going to keep on, you know, keep pushing forward. So, yeah. I hope you guys enjoy my haul. Let me know how you guys like the makeup and all the food finds and all the other stuff I found. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give me a big thumbs up. And, um, hope I didn't forget anything or anybody else. Yeah, like I said, listen out for that giveaway when I reach 500. And, um, uh, be looking out for that collaboration between me and Vienna Rodriguez. And, uh, yeah, um, I think that's all. I will see you guys in the next one.